What is going on everyone? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Shannon with Main Street and Beyond Travel Company. If you can't tell behind me, I am at the Polynesian Village Resort today where there is still a lot of construction going on, but a restaurant has recently reopened here just yesterday. It reopened that I am very excited to go back to. I think you guys know where I'm talking about. Let's head inside. have come to the Polynesian Resort a lot, but I have never noticed this really pretty map up on the wall in the lobby. I love that. It shows all the buildings. You can see the Magic Kingdom. That is really pretty. could not tell by my introduction and my little shots here. We are back at Ohana. Ohana has just reopened yesterday at Disney's Polynesian Resort. We are going to come here for breakfast today. They are open for breakfast and for dinner. We'll do another time, uh, like another dinner review for you all too. But breakfast at Ohana is my absolute favorite on property. So I'm so excited that it is back. The only change is there are no characters right now anymore. When they brought it back, they didn't bring the characters back with it. So. I'm still really excited because the food is incredible and let's go have some breakfast. All right, we have been seated at Ohana and we are so excited. I'm going to put the menu up on the screen for you guys here. Now, since there's no characters here currently, it is going to be a little bit less expensive than it was before. So the breakfast is going to be $25 per adult and $14 per child. And similar to a lot of the other places we've been eating at lately at Disney, it is going to be served family style. So they're gonna bring us out some seasonal fruit, they have a freshly made pineapple coconut breakfast bread, which sounds really good. And then of course, they're gonna bring us the big skillet, which includes scrambled eggs, um, sausage links, Hawaiian style ham uh, topped with uh, pineapple, fried island style potatoes, Mickey shaped waffles, and biscuits. So we are really excited to try all this delicious food for you all. Okay, well our waiter just came and got us some pog juice, which is passion fruit, orange, and guava juice all mixed in. And this is so refreshing. They have it all inside the Polynesian Resort. You can also get it like at Kona Cafe. They also brought a little skillet of our fruit here and then a coconut pineapple bread, which looks really good. All right, I am going to go ahead and try a bite of this pineapple coconut bread. Mm. That is very good light sweetness you can taste the little bits and chunks of the pineapple they have inside hmm. all right our main breakfast platters have arrived we have some super cute stitch and mickey waffles here with some syrup and then of course we have that sausage the country potatoes some biscuits scrambled eggs and ham this looks incredible Look what just arrived to our table. It is the Moana smoothie, which has, um, it is a vanilla smoothie with flavors of watermelon, mango, guava, and ginger topped with whipped cream, edible flowers, and of course, this adorable little Moana chocolate crisp up top. This looks incredible. All right, I am making my way through my plate here. All of this food is absolutely incredible. The waffles, as you can see, were delicious. I am almost done with them here. Sausage is really good, as well as the ham and potatoes, and I already had my biscuit and the coconut bread. Very, very good. And they're still playing the fun music that they always do. I am missing the parade. I wanted to go ahead and give you all a little tip if you're coming here and you want a little bit more of a quieter experience. We luckily got these reservations. Well, Holly and Greg with Chip and Co did. <laughs> and they invited me along, which was so incredibly nice of them because we had an incredible breakfast. But we booked the breakfast for 11.50, which is one of the last dining reservations they can take for breakfast. And it's so nice because there's not that many people in here and it's quiet and the music is playing. It's been a great experience here. The highlights of this restaurant, just look out this window. You get a beautiful view of the grounds of the Polynesian and way off in the distance, I don't know if you all can see it or not, but that's going to be the 
Magic Kingdom Castle, Cinderella's Castle over there. It is absolutely stunning. All right, well, what an incredible breakfast we had this morning at Ohana. It was delicious. The food that came out in the beginning, that pineapple coconut breakfast bread, was actually really good. And I'm not a big pineapple or coconut person, and I ate the whole thing. So that was obviously very good. And then the fruit that came with it was delicious. And then, of course, they brought the big spread, which had Mickey waffles and Stitch waffles that were just super cute. And then the ham with pineapple on top, and then sausage and potatoes. Oh, it was all so good. And again, don't forget with those family style meals, you all can ask for more. So if you run out of Mickey waffles, ask for more if you want some. But I promise I'm going to get back to Ohana very soon and do a dinner review for you all, which will hopefully be just as delicious. But thank you all so much for watching. Again, if you're new here, please be sure to hit that subscribe button. And until next time, guys, stay magical.